All right, across Texas, one of Houston's oldest black cemeteries took a real beating during Hurricane Barrel. Yeah, dozens of trees fell on top of the Olive, Olive Wood Cemetery and it damaged headstones. As reporter Troy Class explains tonight, the families of people who are buried there are now asking the community for help with a cleanup. This, this is disheartening. Margo Williams has walked through the plots at Olive Wood many times before. Leaders of Houston's post-emancipation era are interred here. Others include doctors, lawyers, and World War I veterans. These markers here mark people who helped, the they helped build Houston, they helped build Texas, they helped build the United States, they served their country. Margo's grandfather and great-grandparents are buried here. There was no defense from the powerful winds of the derecho. And then come um, Barrel, now we've lost more trees, lost more headstones. There probably was a dozen headstones in May. Now we've got more headstones that are gone. Headstones like these uprooted by large pecan trees and others. Williams had the property evaluated after the derecho and got a quote for $250,000 to clean up the entire property. Some volunteers have since cleaned up as piles of trees lay by the plots. But Williams says she's praying for help with her plan to preserve the history of one of Houston's oldest black cemeteries. It's going to take uh, some experts with this too, but this really makes me feel a little, yeah, a, a lot discouraged because, you know, we were really making strides for the cemetery. As Troy Class reporting this evening, William says the property is being reevaluated today and they're hoping to get a better estimate. We also understand city council members are getting involved trying to see what other resources uh, can be used to help cover the cleanup cost.